हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू डी शो क्लास टुडे वी लर्न स्टैंडर्ड एट सोशल साइंस न्यू एन सी आर टी टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी टू चैप्टर नाइन रिसोर्सेज के हम क्वेश्चन आंसर देखेंगे एक्सरसाइज के क्वेश्चन वन राइट द आंसर्स ऑफ द फॉलोइंग क्वेश्चन इन वन सेंटेंस फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन व्हाट इज नेचुरल वेजिटेशन सेल्फ ग्रोइंग वेजिटेशन इंक्लूड क्रीपर्स श्रब्स एंड ट्रीज आर कॉल्ड नेचुरल वेजिटेशन सेकेंड क्वेश्चन विच एनिमल्स आर इंक्लूडेड इन वाइल्ड लाइफ आंसर वेरियस एनिमल्स लायन टाइगर एलिफेंट डियर एक्सेट्रा एंड वेरियस बर्ड्स एंड इंसेक्ट्स आर द पार्ट्स ऑफ वाइल्ड लाइफ थर्ड क्वेश्चन On what basis are natural vegetation classified? So, natural vegetations are classified into three broad categories: forest, grassland, and shrubs. Fourth question: What should be done to increase the water storage capacity of lakes and ponds? By removing silt deposited in ponds and lakes. and deepening them will increase water storage question 2 answer the following questions first question describe the types of resources based on their distribution answer scholars classified the types of resources as follows ubiquitous resources this type of resources are available everywhere example gases which are useful for the living beings are present in the atmosphere like oxygen and nitrogen second common resources generally such resources are readily available to us for example water pasture land third rare resources these resources are available to us from limited places for example coal various metals mineral oils natural gas uranium four unequalities resources minerals minerals rarely found in one or two places all over the world are known as solitary resource for example cryolite from greenland europe second question distinguish renewable resources and non renewable resources so renewable resources automatically replenish the quantity used in a specific time period or is inexhaustible for example forests animals and birds sunlight wind non renewable resource once used it is impossible to get it renewed it in the new near future For example, coal, crude oil, natural gas, nuclear minerals. Third question. Write a short note about human resource. Man himself is a powerful resource. He uses various in elements of nature as a resource through his own knowledge and skills. He is both the creator and user of the resources. using his intellect he selected the best element available in the nature we can make maximum use of natural resources only when we have the skills abilities knowledge or technology education and health services make man a special resource this process of making human resource is called a human resource development question 4 what are the main factors responsible for water crisis 
factors like population expulsion increase in cultivation of cash crops modern lifestyle urbanization industries deforestation are mainly responsible for water crisis question 5 what is an ecosystem explain in detail in an ecosystem any organism on this basis survives by interacting with another organism vegetation fulfills many of our needs every organism large and small has a unique role to play in the ecosystem every factor in an ecosystem depends on every other factor directly or indirectly a change in the temperature of an ecosystem will often affect what plants will grow there for instance animals that depend on plants for food and shelter will have to adapt to the changes move to another ecosystem or perish question 6 forests are very useful to us explain the statement uh, forests satisfy many of our diverse needs such as billows first forests keep the balance of oxygen and carbon dioxide in the atmosphere timber and fuel wood it prevention of soil erosion ground water conservation various fruits herbs edible gum raw materials for industry etc we get meat leather for wool it is a from forest so forests are very useful to us question 7 stage the measures conservation of resources measures of the resource conservation are such below first prevent soil erosion as it reduces fertility take special measures to prevent pastures and deforestation in forest areas water scarcity can be prevented by rain water harvesting by removing soil deposit in ponds and lakes and deepening them will increase water storage use recycled water excessive irrigation reduces the productivity of the soil so increase drip irrigation the use of chemical fertilizers lower soil quality in a, in the long run so use it wisely and use natural manure instead it is the duty of all of a, us to convert resources explain the statement resources are important for human life our life is unimaginable without them with the growing population and the extraordinary development of technology the use of resources is increase increasing day by day in this situation some resources are on the verge of getting over human progress and modern lifestyle will unable to survive in the absence of resources one should think about the future situation resources should be used in a planned and judicious manner question 3 find and write the correct option from the following options yahan pe option nahi hai answer liya diya hua hai first long term use of chemical fertilizer reduces soil quality second which of the following resources is non renewable so coal and third which of the following is a rare resources so cryolite thank you Thank you.